Another type of what if tool is the scenario manager. And what's neat about the scenario manager is that it lets you change several cells of data instead of just one to see what the scenario or the outcome could be. So to get a scenario going, you go to the data tab, data tools, what if, scenario manager. Then we would need to add the scenario that we want and give it a name. So in this one we're going to call it current expenses. And then instead of just B7, we're going to change B10 through B17. And then we're going to hit OK. Then we want to add another scenario called best case scenario. So we're going to choose add. And in this scenario, we're going to choose best case scenario. And next to B10, we're going to hit OK. Next to B10, we want to change that to 85,000. And next to B11, we want to type 7,000. And we're going to click Add again, and we're going to call this Worst Case Scenario. Hit OK. Next to B10, we're going to type 105000. Next to B11, we're going to type 85123. So now you can see that we've got our three scenarios added there, and we want to get the summary. So I'm going to click Summary, and it asks what I want the summary to be of the results. We're going to leave it there on net income. And the summary is going to pop up here with our current expenses, with none of the numbers have changed, our best case scenario, and our worst case scenario. And it shows you the change down here at the bottom. All in one chart.